take me long to come back, did it? So today is New Year's Eve, so I thought I would vlog today and potentially tomorrow, depending on how I'm feeling. So I have got a party at this golf club tonight. So we're going there with Ed's mum and dad and uh, George and Becky. And I am just going now to, um, we've got, we have uh, chosen our new car. So we've got to go and sign this document. And that's really exciting. And then uh, I'm going to pop into the shopping centre nearby to there and just have a little look around, see what I can find. I think I've got my outfit for tonight. I'm just going to wear that black jumpsuit. But um, I just thought I'd show you what I'm wearing now. Do excuse the mess everywhere. The room is a tip. It's like, I really need to do it. <laughs> so I've just got on this shirt, which is from H&M. And uh, I got this in Athens. I got this skirt, which was from Primark. And you will see that in my little Primark haul. Just tights and my usual boots. And then I picked this leather jacket up for £15 from as did yesterday, so uh, reduced from 30, so that's quite a bargain. Just popped my hair in a French plait because I need to wash it before we go out. And it's a bit unruly, so there we go. Gosh, I look a little bit windswept now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure half a car park has just seen my bum. I've got that skirt on and it's just like catching the wind because it's got like, um, it's like a wraparound skirt. So like it just completely catches it. So yeah, pretty sure half of the car park have just seen my bum. Never mind. We went and signed the documentation. So we're just waiting to hear that that's all all right. Um, won't be for a few days and then we'll know that the, uh, the cars can go through, which is extremely exciting. I cannot believe it. So before I start to get ready, I thought I'd just show you what I got from TK Maxx. So I picked up, I got this, um, it's kind of like a dress thing. It's Kind of, the fabric is not a fabric that I like. It's like that really, like, oh, I don't know what you call it, but it's kind of stretchy and it's a bit shiny. I don't usually like this sort of fabric, but um, it looks quite nice on and I really like the bell sleeves on it. And that was reduced to, I think, £7. Then I got this, which I love. It is a complete onesie. I haven't had, like, a chill-out onesie like ever like this it's really thick and really really nice and this is by bedroom athletics <laughs> and this was reduced from 16.99 to eight pounds as well which is really really good i think for that because the quality is gorgeous it's also got hood on then i got this which i'm contemplating wearing tonight which is a white shirt it's just a classic white shirt but it's got black on the collar and also it's just got like black um strip down the um front and also like black buttons and to wear with that, I got these um, trousers. They've got like the, what, like, what do you call it? Like the paper bag top, high-waisted paper bag top. And they're just really like wide. And they were reduced to £10. I don't know who they buy. They buy BAF, Be a Friend of Lovely Pants and Fashion. <laughs> so I don't really know how much they were. Um, no, I do know how much about the retainer, but um, well, they were twenty pounds originally. That's all right then. So yeah, I don't know what to wear really. It'd either be with that, with that, or I've got that black jumpsuit, the old, the old trusty jumpsuit. Almost forgot I picked these up as well. These Steve Madden sunglasses. These are twelve ninety nine, but they're like super reflective in the light, like when it's the sun shining. They're really, really reflective, and I really like them because they've got like cut out bits on all around them, which I thought was different. So yeah, and they're Steve Madden, they were on the floor. Super quick outfit of the night. I've just gone for a classic red lip. I have got this shirt on, which has got the um, black panelling, the uh, trousers as well, and some shoes I got from Primark that were about <laughs> three pound or something stupid ages ago. So that is my outfit. I've just got to put my jewelry on, my nails are like that, and that's it, gotta go. <laughs> George and Ed are the first to get food as usual. And champagne. And champagne. More champagne. Cheers, boys! We've just had some chilli and rice and some um, salad, so not too bad, quite similar well friendly, but I think the champagne is just not good. Yeah. It looks very smart, So we've just got these for those, so we're like. What is all that
Club now and we are heading home you probably can't see oh a light come on you can probably see me a little bit better now so there is Edward and uh, it's about two o'clock in the morning now we're walking home my feet are absolutely killing me oh it's gone dark anyway guys I'm gonna leave <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here so it's our anniversary tomorrow so I'll catch you tomorrow we're gonna go for a meal as we always do on uh, New Year's Day Ed. Oh god, I'm gonna go guys because you can't even see me. Sorry if you're squeamish guys, but can we just take a moment to appreciate the fact I've just walked all the way home with the mashed ankles. Not one, but two. Oh my god, that is so vile. Good morning and happy new year. I hope you all had a really good night last night. I feel a little bit worse for wear this morning. We drank quite a bit yeah, and <laughs> quite a bit of champagne which uh don't usually do very much but it was uh really really nice it was a nice night but my ankles are absolutely mashed if you were following me on snapchat you'll see how mashed my ankles got but they were really bad because we had to walk home but uh no it was a good night but today we are heading into town and we're going to san carlo which is the restaurant that we go to every um new year's day because it's mine and Ed's anniversary today and it's 10 years, been to the 10 years. So, um, Ace Warren Dad and coming with us, and George and Becky, uh, just to come and have a meal with us. Back home now, we've been walking around town with Ace Mom and Dad and George and Beck, and uh, just picked up a couple of bits from Victoria's Secret. Got um. Um, like a sports bar and stuff so yeah it was really nice and uh, dinner was absolutely delicious I love um, I love San Carlo it's one of my favourites so I am um, we're just gonna have like a quick nap I think and then we're actually going out for Chinese <laughs> because we're making the most of it this is my last day eating anything bad and then I'm straight back on Swimming World tomorrow which I'm excited about so 
we're going for a Chinese and then that'll be that basically so I totally did not end up having a nap it's only about half an hour later now mm -hmm. and I just was literally watching YouTube videos catching up on all your comments and stuff and I uploaded my Primark haul which is now live as well so we are gonna head out for this Chinese now. I'm so cold and uh, you know, I just wanna be really, really warm, but I'm looking forward to this last meal, last bad thing, and then tomorrow is on it. So I'm gonna have whatever I want tonight and then that'll be that. I'm back home now, went for a Chinese. I'm absolutely stuffed, I can't believe I've eaten out twice today. I feel like a humongous fat pig. It's been really, really nice. It's been nice to have some meals and just not think about doing well for a couple of weeks like because you do have to be on the ball all the time and it can be difficult as everyone knows tomorrow is a new beginning and just starting again and just ready to sort my body out and get summer ready i suppose so hopefully i can do it and i'm going to be doing some videos just trying to get everyone motivated because it's so hard after all that so fingers crossed i can I'm just having a drumstick though to make the most of it or two. So I will catch you guys soon on vlogs and also on um, on like my Slimming World videos and stuff. So I will see you then. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.